Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Poly channel. This video I want to share about sneak peek for 6 September 2023 maintenance update. Okay, to enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, this is a server official website for service maintenance notice at 6 September 2023. And special for SEA and Thailand server, this maintenance will occur for 24 hour full time starting at 6 September 2023 at 5 a.m. GMT plus 8 until next day 7 September 2023 at 5 a.m. GMT plus 8. And the reason for this 24 hour maintenance, because SEA server and Thailand server will get crossplay update. So after 7 September 2023 maintenance update done, any player on SEA and Thailand server can meet together on same server. And more detail about this crossplay update between SEA and Thailand server, you can check my previous video about duplicate name solution mechanic when I explaining more detail about this SEA and Thailand crossplay update. And for any SEA and Thailand server, just prepare for upcoming huge reward because of this crossplay update. But for any other region server outside SEA and Thailand server, this maintenance will occur as normal. But for more detail for each region server, make sure you check your own region official website. And for SEA and Thailand server, also will got website maintenance at the same time for 24 hour. But support maintenance will occur until 6 September 2023 at 8 am GMT plus 8. Okay, next, the reason for this week maintenance update, other than Thailand and SEA server will get crossplay update, they also will implement any Guild War system. And this change for Guild War system, surprisingly, this update just come from last global app update at 1 September 2023 when I mentioning about TR5 not war. And after this maintenance done, not more schedule for each node will be adjust following on this table that you can check this table on my previous video about global lab update at 1 September 2023. And also they will adjust name for tier not war that previously tier 1 divided between two difficulty and they will adjust all this difficulty to become tier 1 until tier 5. So actually tier 5 not war is same as previous tier 4. And also they will improve metal exchange reward after this maintenance done, especially reducing how much medal that you need to get any reward from this exchange. And they also will add new reward for exchange this medal, especially for any kind of boss defense gear. And also you can exchange some perfume and elixir from this medal. Okay, next reason for this week maintenance update, they will reduce server move white time. So at least we got this reduce cooldown server change. After this maintenance done, that this cooldown will be reduced from 10 minutes to become 5 minutes only. So after this maintenance done, you can change server with less cooldown. Okay, the next reason for this week maintenance update, at least they will implement this karma family base. After this maintenance done, because they will revamp this karma system to become family base, all player will have 300,000 karma instantly. And be careful if you reduce your karma after this maintenance done, this karma will bound to your account, not spared per character anymore. So if you reduce this karma, all your character in your account will have some number of karma like they do on Naval Fame. Okay, the next reason for this update, this is the most anticipated update for any player on Black Desert World, is change Marnie Realm system. So at least they will implement this rechargeable Marnie Realm after this maintenance done. And more detail about this rechargeable Marnie Realm, you can check my explanation on last global lab update at 4 August 2023. Okay, the next reason for this week maintenance update, they will add Atanis element. Actually, about this Atanis element, I just mentioned it on Black Desert Weekly News at first week September 2023 when I mentioning about infinite potion new source material. So after this maintenance done, if you grinding on low until mid-tier monster zone like my forest, polyforest, soldier cemetery, desert naga temple, titium valley, basim, kadri, crescent temple, fadus, and Porti Cave, you have chance to get this Atanis element. And function for this Atanis element, 
you can exchange it to become any infinite potion material, either HP and MP, and also you can exchange it to become any kind of fruit, including fruit of enchantment. And you also can exchange it to become Crocodile Stone for this 20 pieces Atanis element. And you also can sell this Atanis element to any NPC vendor for 1 million silver. So by this information, you can more easily get any kind of infinite potion material because this is become general infinite potion material that you can exchange it to become any type. And this is not an event but permanent content that will stay forever on Black Desert World. Okay, next reason for this update, they will add Blessing of the Morning Light buff to the Black Shrine content. And this update just implement from last Global Lab update at 25 August 2023 when I mentioning about plus 1 AP and DP and also plus 20% drop rate buff from Morning Light Blessing. So after this maintenance done, if you success to defeat any boss on Black Shrine content, especially for level Calamity level 6 or 7, you will activate Morning Light Blessing for 180 minutes on your specific server when you locate it. And server buff that will active is depend on Black Shrine boss that you defeat, that you can get plus 1 AP if you defeat any boss that have weakness Fire Aura, like Golden Picking, Duoxini, and Apex Changui. And if you defeat any kind of boss that have weakness Moon Aura, you will get plus 1 DP, like Bari, Songaxi, or Bamboo Legion. And the last, if you defeat any kind of boss that have weakness Earth Aura, you will get server buff plus 20% drop rate, and this boss is Sangun, Gumiho, Duoxini, or Emoji. And this server buff, especially for AP and DP, will buff your AP and DP that will affect on your AP and DP bracket. And more detail when I check it on Korea server, you can check my previous video about Black Desert Weekly News at first week September 2023 when I follow up about new AP and DP buff info on this video. And the next reason for this week maintenance update, they will add Margoria Pirate Fleet. And about this Margoria Pirate Fleet, this update just come from last Global Lab update at 18 August 2023 when I mentioning about new sea monster. And this Margoria Pirate Fleet is special sea monster that you can find it near this fell realm, especially on this area on map on Margoria Sea. And this is any item that can be dropped from this Margoria Pirate Fleet. But more detail about about this monster zone, I will test it later after this maintenance done, so stay tuned on Chris Poly channel. Okay, next reason for this update, they will add silver buff to Ulukita and Land of the Morning Light. But take notice, silver buff that they mention on this website is about priest buff that you can get it by paying some silver. And this update about this priest buff on Ulukita and Land of the Morning Light. This update just come from last Global Lab update at 25 August 2023 when I mentioning about priest buff on Ulukita region that we can get this buff from Zezek Mercenary Camp at Ulukita region. Specifically from Burhan NPC, not manager at this Zezek Mercenary Camp. And about expansion for priest buff from Land of the Morning Light, you can get it from any village on this Land of Morning Light including on Banbahwi Mountain. And this is any NPC that you can get this priest buff on Land of the Morning Light. So if you want to encounter any boss on Land of Morning Light, you didn't need to go back to Dalbeol village anymore. You just need to meet any NPC around this area. And more detail when I show you about any NPC on Land of the Morning Light that will give you priest buff. I already show you detail info for this Land of Morning Light priest buff on last Black Desert Weekly News at first week September 2020. You can check it for more detail. Okay, the next reason for this week maintenance update, they will add auto complete feature on central market search menu. And this update just come from last global lab update at 25 August 2023. So after this maintenance done, you can search specific item more easy just by typing some letter on the central market search menu. And you can choose any item from this auto complete function for specific item that you want. Okay, that's all the reason for this week maintenance update and any other update that they didn't mention on this website will following from last Global Lab update at 25 August 2023. You can check it for more detail. 
And some additional info for you, actually this content update preview that they mentioned, this is come from SEA server, but if I check my NAS server official website for service maintenance notice at 6 September 2023, my NAS server update preview just some part from SEA and Thailand server update, but I'm not sure if all this update will come to any other region server outside SEA and Thailand server, or maybe they just didn't mention it on MENA server. So make sure you check your own region official website for update preview on this week to make sure any update that I already mentioned previously. Okay, next about ending event. On SEA server, there are 9 event that will be end after this maintenance done. Okay, first event that will end is Black Desert Festa, X 2023 Hedel Ball, Coupon and Rewards Reveal. Actually, some of this event or the end previously, but this is remind you about special code from this Hedel Ball 2023 that will be expired after 5 September 2023 server reset time. So make sure you claim this coupon code from Hedel Ball 2023 if you never claim it before, before it's expired at 5 September 2023 after reset time. And actually, there are two code that will expire that still related with this Hedel Ball 2023. And this is another one for this code, so make sure you claim both of this code, because both of this code will be expired at 5 September 2023 after reset time. And if you didn't want to miss any code update that per abyss release for any region server, and also any video update that I release every day, make sure you join to my official Discord server by using this invitation link, and everyone can join to my official Discord server by free. Okay, the next event that will be end is a small gift prepared with Heartfield Gratitude. Actually, this is another coupon code that I already mentioned previously, so make sure you claim this code before 5 September 2023 server reset time. Okay, the next event that will end is Rise and Prevail in Arena of Solare. But take notice this event ending for Arena of Solare, this is only apply for SEA and Thailand server, because SEA and Thailand server will get crossplay update and previous just and this Arena of Solare for this season early, special for SEA and Thailand server only. But for any other region server, this Arena of Solare event still there until 13 September 2023 before maintenance. And this ending period that will end at 6 September 2023, this is only for SEA and Thailand server. And because of this early end of this Arena of Solare, they have no plan to create commemorative NPC winner on Duel Arena for this season, special for SEA and Thailand server. But for any other region server, all this Arena of Solare event still occur as normal. Okay, the next event that will end on SEA server, still about Arena of Solare event, about new master of the Essen. So make sure you finish this Arena of Solare special quest event from Black Spirit to get 1000 G gold bar 3 pieces from this 3 quest, and also total crownstone 600 pieces, and special for final quest you can get advice of work plus 100 from this quest line. And next event that will end is new and returning receive gift just by logging in. And this is about new and returning player login reward that will be end its period until 6 September 2023 before reset time. And I'm sure after this maintenance done, they will renew this special login reward for new and returning player. And the next event that will end is summer twitch drop. So this twitch drop event will be end at 6 September 2023 on specific time. So make sure you claim all reward from this twitch drop event before this event end. And the next event that will end is ready to reel in puffer fish. So this puffer fish fishing event will end at 6 September 2023 before maintenance. And make sure you fish this puffer fish on their hotspot to get special title from this fish event. And the next event that will end special on SEA and Thailand server is about pre-download now for SEA and Thailand crossplay. So make sure if you play on SEA or Thailand server, you do this pre-download client for new client on this crossplay server. And after this maintenance done, because SEA and Thailand server just got crossplay update, we will using new client to play Black Desert online and all client we can 
cannot use it anymore and you can freely to uninstall your old client after this maintenance done and the reward for this event you will get all this reward if you play on SEA and Thailand server that they will send all this reward to our in-game mail after 6 September 2023 maintenance update especially at 7 September 2023 after this maintenance done and don't worry for Steam user, you also can get all this reward after this maintenance done. And the last event that will end is item collection rate plus 100%. So after this maintenance done, this item drop rate buff for 100% will be gone. And make sure you maximize this item drop rate buff before this maintenance start to get any treasure item that you aim. And more detail to maximize your item drop rate buff, you can check my previous video when I guide you about HP and MP infinite potion guide because any tips and tricks about item drop rate buff that I guide you on this video, you can implement it for any other treasure item that you want. Okay, that's all any event that will end on SEA server and make sure you check your own region official website. Maybe there are special event that also will be end that only occur on your regional server only. Okay, next some review for ending sale from Pershop after 6 September 2023 maintenance update. If you check hot and new and go to event tab, if you play on SEA or Thailand server, make sure you purchase any 100 silver purchase. That will end its sell period after 6 September 2023 maintenance update. And then if you go to sell tab, there are some sell that will end its sell period, especially for family inventory weight limit that have discount 15% during this event period. And also if you go to best tab, there are some ending sell for Selene outfit pack that you also can purchase any kind of weapon outfit from this pack that have discount 20% that will end after this maintenance start. But but don't worry any kind of Selene outfit, this outfit sale is available for any time permanently on your per shop. This is just end sale period for its package. And then this is end sale period for this fluffy bunny pet sale that have discount 20%. Prank KB pet that have discount 10%, 4 plus 2 wizard gossip pack, and any kind of package that you can check it yourself and purchase them depend on your needs. Okay, that's all review about Pershop ending sale before 6 September 2023 maintenance update. And then after this maintenance done, they will release new outfit, Stagian right? And this outfit will be available for Ninja, Musa, Striker, and Berserker. And as you can see, this is how it looks for this outfit for Striker class. But sadly, this outfit you cannot use Hide Cap feature to get another look, but you can use Hide Visor function to open and close his mask. And the most interesting thing, when you close his mask, this mask A will become glowing like this. And this outfit is outfit set only that spared from its helmet armor, glove, and shoes. So this outfit didn't have any weapon outfit from this set. And this is how it looks for ninja class. And this is for Musa class. And the last for Berserker class. So if you interest with this outfit, you can prepare some pearl to purchase it from Pershop. And because this outfit is permanent outfit that will be available on Pershop anytime, you also can get it from Central Market using silver if someone sell it. And more detail about this outfit preview, you can check on my Black Desert Weekly News at first week September 2023 when I mentioning about upcoming new outfit preview. Okay, that's all sneak peek for service maintenance notice at 6 September 2023. And special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. And also my current member, Dubia Dut, Doki, Angel, Ayrton, Snot, Soren, Alt, Afrilka, Elfamilia, Drunken Video, Jeff as Gold member. And also for all my silver and bronze member, thank you so much for all your direct support. This is will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video depend on your support level. And be noticed at some level there are have some limit, so make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. 
and I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching. See you next time.